Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Copper Jacket TV. So once again, Judge Benitez earns the title St. Benitez. A California law more than 100 years old has been overturned by a federal judge. Let's go ahead and talk about what's going on here. Now, before we get started, if you haven't done so already, I, I would really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button. It's free, it only takes a second, but it really helps us out quite a bit to spread our message to as many people as possible. And that little alarm bell will let you know when new videos come out. So with that being said, let's get to it. Okay, so let's go and talk about what's going on here. So once again, Judge Roger Benitez has given California another big Second Amendment win. If you know anything about Judge Benitez, you know that when he comes out with an order, it is always very thorough and very long. He knows that pretty much everything that he does that sides with the Constitution in California is going to get appealed up to the Ninth Circuit. So he basically puts every ounce of effort into covering all of his bases. For instance, in the case that we're talking about today, which is Fouts v. Bonta, we have a stack. This is before my printer ran out of paper. We're still missing 14 more pages out of this order right here, but we have a stack of papers that outlines why he gave the opinion that he did. Now, he granted a motion for a summary judgment, so he sided with the plaintiffs in this case, and what he stated was, the California ban on so-called billy clubs is unconstitutional. Now, you might be asking yourself, uh, you know, what? why is that such a big deal? I don't really care about that. Well, it is a huge deal because it's another Second Amendment blow to the state of California who has done everything in their power now for decades. I mean, these have been banned for almost 100 years. They have done everything in their power to take away every possible avenue for you to defend yourself. So they, they don't even allow people to carry sticks. If it's considered a club, then that's the end of it. So you can't carry anything that's expandable, nothing that fits in your pocket. You can't carry what the police have. You can't carry any of that stuff in the state of California because it was banned. Well, Judge Benitez, again, using Bruin, determined that California can't do that. Doesn't matter if it's a 85 year old law. It is unconstitutional. Right, let's just go ahead and take a look at the last page of Judge Benitez's order here, and that'll kind of explain to you uh, really what he, how he feels about it. So Judge Benitez writes here in conclusion, and once again, this kind of explains how he feels about the topic. It says, conclusion, the Second Amendment protects a citizen's right to defend oneself with dangerous and lethal firearms, but not everybody wants to carry a firearm for self-defense. Some prefer less lethal weapons. A billy is a less lethal weapon that may be used for self-defense. It is a simple weapon that most anybody between the ages of eight and 80 can fashion from a wooden stick or a clothes pole or a dowel rod. One can easily imagine countless citizens carrying these weapons on daily walks and hikes to defend themselves against attacks from humans or animals. To give full life to the core right of self-defense, every law-abiding responsible individual citizen has a constitutionally protected right to keep and bear arms like the billy for lawful purposes. In early America today, the Second Amendment right of self self-preservation permits a citizen to repel force by force when the intervention of society in his behalf may be too late to prevent that injury. The founders of our country anticipated that as our nation matured, circumstances might make the previous recognition of rights uh, undesirable or inadequate. For that, event, for that event, the founders provided a built-in vehicle by which constitution could be amended but a single state, no matter how well intended, may not do so, and neither can this court. Plaintiffs in this case challenge California's Penal Code Section 22210 as it applies to Billy. It is declared that the prohibition on Billy unconstitutionally infringes on the Second Amendment rights of American citizens and is hereby enjoined. It is hereby ordered that summary judgment is entered for the plaintiffs. The following... A uh, permanent injunction is effective immediately. One, Defendant Attorney General Rob Bonta and his officers, agents, servants, employees, and attorneys, and those persons in active concert 
or participation with him and those duly sworn state peace officers and federal law enforcement officers who gain knowledge of this injunction order or know of the existence of this injunction order are enjoined from implementing or enforcing California Penal Code Section 22210 as it applies to the Billy. It is so ordered, dated February 23rd, Judge Roger T. Benitez. So I don't know about you, but those those last two pages, the conclusion and the order, were very, very powerful statements on the Second Amendment from Judge Benitez, and I think they carry a lot of weight. Now, as I'm sure you all guessed, the state of California appealed this pretty much immediately, right? I mean, they have their appeals pretty much preset before these things are determined. They know that what they're doing is wrong. They know what they're doing is unconstitutional. And so they have their appeals ready. So it's been appealed to the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. But like I said earlier, I have a feeling in this particular case, the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals is not going to overturn uh, the judge's decision in this case. Just based on what happened in Hawaii, again, with butterflies and stuff, I don't think that uh, we're going to see this be overturned, which would be a huge step for a lot of people who just, uh, ju like Judge Benita says, don't want to carry something that is lethal. They want to carry something that is less lethal. And this gives them an option to defend themselves that is perfect for that particular scenario. So I, I think this is a great order. It's another big one from Judge Benitez, another pro-Second Amendment ruling, another tell California that what you're doing is wrong. And that again is, is just massive. So regardless if it's something that's big and major and gets a lot of people talking and it's huge, uh, I still think that this is a very big win and needs to be taken seriously. So I wanted to share it with you and I want to thank you all very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Please like subscribe. You guys have a great day.